Uh, Brett is Stevenson Athletics. Uh, they go hand in hand, kind of like Old Bay and Crabs, Preakness in Maryland, and good old William Wallace in Scotland. Uh, 30 years as the only director of athletics uh, is an absolutely amazing achievement. Um, when I think about Brett and Stevenson Athletics, I think about all Brett has brought to the department with his selfless devotion to the university. First, I want to thank the conference for selecting Brett for the Lou Sorrento Award. This is an award that goes beyond the boundaries of a particular sport or a school and serves the athletic community as a whole. Brett is this kind of individual. Brett Adams, what can you say about Brett Adams? Uh, the man bleeds green and black. Um, 20 years ago, I came to interview uh, for the opportunity. I, was, I just needed to come back to the area and I thought I'll spend a year or two uh, in the Baltimore area and uh, met with Brett and from the very first moment was buying in or completely bought in to the dream and the vision that Brett had for what was then Village Lily College and is now Stevenson University. Um, I just, you know, he's just infectious with, with what he wants to do and the opportunities he wants to create. I don't know if there's another athletic director in the country who is constantly thinking about what opportunities can we provide for students so that they can achieve their athletic dreams or their athletic hopes um, at all different levels. In my 18 years here, the growth of our athletics department has been truly phenomenal. Um, he has been able to bring a vision to our athletic department to uh, grow and build more opportunities um, for all our student athletes, whether it be through our new facilities or through our sports. Um, 29 varsity sports, now many club sports, around 700 NCAA student athletes, new athle athletic facilities um, at our East Campus, um, all down to the great leadership Brett, Brett has provided. On a personal note, I'm thankful for what Brett has brought to Stevenson University. He first began as our athletic director in 1994 with no teams and no facilities. He came with a passion to make a difference in the students' lives, and that's exactly what he's done, building the facilities and the programs you see here at the university today. Brett was an amazing coach, not just tennis, but basketball and all the other things that he's been a part of in, in the coaching world. Uh, he has taken those skills of being a head coach and, and really treated being an athletic director exactly like that. You know, we are his team. Every member of the team is important. Uh, he makes time for everyone. Uh, he's an athletic director who's not just at a couple home games a week. He's at every home event since I've been here. I've been here almost 20 years and he's just at every home event and it's it's not just football. It's you know it's women's tennis, it's women's golf, it's acro and tumbling, it's it's um, uh, you know, men's golf and the lacrosses and the soccers and and his passion is unmatched when it comes to supporting the student athlete. Brett will do anything not only for our department but for the university and the greater good. He never says no. Well sometimes. Uh, but he's all about creating solutions. Brett truly embodies a team player who will always look to help others, um, other departments on campus, uh, utilizing our athletic department and students to help out whatever is needed, whether it be for hosting championships, serving on committees, uh, moving in first year students, uh, wearing a green man suit for the pep rally, which was pretty funny. Um, and also breaking world records for the most uh, yoga ball workout uh, on our stadium turf field. Uh, his energy and passion is unmatched uh, and really he will do anything for the university and Stevenson Athletics. So as Stevenson has grown, Brett's passion is, is being played out. It's being shown to, to everyone, not just in the MAC, but nationwide, that Stevenson University wants to provide the most amazing opportunities for their students who want to be a part of athletics in whatever way, whether it's club, esports, um, or, or NCAA sports. He is a true pioneer, uh, and it has been an absolute honor to work with him, to have him as my mentor, uh, and, and most importantly, to have him as just an amazing friend that, that I will cherish forever. Congratulations, Brett, on this prestigious award. You are so very deserving.
of this award for all you have given to Stevenson University, the conference, and the NCAA. You truly care about Division III athletics, and you have always placed our student athletes' educational and athletic experience as your top priority in an inclusive and equitable environment. Congratulations, buddy. I can't think of another person who is more deserving of this award. Congratulations to you, Brett. And again, thank you for honoring him today.